वेलकम टू दिस चैनल टू व्यू लिस्ट ऑफ टॉपिक ऑफ योर इंटरेस्ट गो टू प्ले लिस्ट एंड सिलेक्ट इट टू इंक्रीज द स्पीड ऑफ नरेशन क्लिक ऑन थ्री डॉट्स एज अब एंड इनक्रीज द स्पीड फ्रॉम नॉर्मल टू हायर वंस टू एंजॉय वीडियोज प्लीज यूज हेडफोन्स थैंक यू नेचर डिजाइन थिंग्स यूजिंग दिस गोल्डन रेशो कॉल एज फाइव वेन यू सम अप नंबर इन सीरीज यू गेट दिस गोल्डन रेशो नंबर स्टार्टिंग विथ जीरो This is first Fibonacci number, then one. If you add one into zero, you get one. If you again add one into one, you get two. If you add two into one, you get three. So if you add three into two, you get five. Again, if you add five into three, you get eight. Similarly, if you go on adding numbers, you will get this Fibonacci sequence. Let's find golden ratio using excel sheet. Open an excel sheet and write down Fibonacci number and you write down here the golden ratio or Fibonacci ratio. The very first number is 0 then 1. These are two initial Fibonacci numbers. So if I add this one plus previous 0 it gives me 1. Again if I add this number plus previous number it gives me 2. Again I repeat the formula this number plus previous number it gives me 3 so if i keep repeating this formula i get this fibonacci numbers and if i want to put a ratio in place this number divided by previous number gives me this ratio and if i keep repeating this you can find out i get the golden ratio if i have to summarize this you can find at this place The ratio is 1.6180, and after number 233, the ratio continues to be approximately same. If you go upwards, expanding further, you will find the same ratio over and over. This is called as golden ratio, which is followed by nature. Golden ratio is nothing but perfection in building something whether it is by nature or human being. For example from nature's creation you can find the flowers having petals ranging from 1 to 34. Is 2 3 5 8 13 21 34. 34. This number is followed by nature. Another example from nature's creation the size of petal area are increasing in Fibonacci sequence. If you plot the Fibonacci squares in the respective size of squares you will get the spiral line joining them together as shown here you can find if i plot 0 plus 1 one square then another one square and the area of 2 and the area equal to 3 units then area equal to 5 units then 8 units and 13 units 21 and 34 and 55 so on if i go on to connect this diagonals of the squares you will get a perfect spiral line similarly the nature also increases the size of flower petals or sizes of the growing plant leaves in fibonacci sequence the leaf size is 1 you can see the 2 then it is 3 then 4 5 6 7 8 and so on another example from nature are spider man's net it perfectly follows the fibonacci sequence your hands proportion hands is divided in ratio of 1 is to 1.618 your body is also divided from the navel 1 to 0.618 in the same sequence your ear sequence following the fibonacci circle your fingers are in the size of 1 2 3 the length is following fibonacci sequence again golden ratio is nothing but perfection in building something whatever it is by nature or human being an example followed by a great architect artist and musician to build attractive great buildings or structures the structural example is like taj mahal in india notre dame paris artists creating great paintings are following the fibonacci sequence fibonacci spiral curves musicians composing great music is nothing but fibonacci sequence the instruments are created in the length of fibonacci sequence
guitar and the intervals between keys on piano are nothing but a Fibonacci numbers 8 keys, 13 keys in one octave a number so important that it could be used across the disciplines of mathematics and physics and a number so profoundly purposeful that the natural world and the universe would bend to its whims the Fibonacci sequence is a string of numbers that begins with 0 and 1 which can be extended infinitely by adding up any two consecutive numbers to find the next in sequence the golden ratio is a mathematical term used to describe the relationship of two figures whereby the number seems to be some form of complementary ratio to link the Fibonacci sequence and the golden ratio we must look at the ratio between two consecutive numbers in Fibonacci. The golden ratio has fascinated the world's most knowledgeable people for millennia since its discovery and we have seen its influence in some of the finest works mankind has ever produced. Is the golden ratio a universal law applied by nature? The evidence seems to suggest so and the aforementioned Leonardo da Vinci may have alluded to this in some of his most famous works. Thank you.